this year we have to get it done. The political bickering is finally over. The deal nearly done. Adult New Yorkers should be able to legally light up within the next week. It'll take effect immediately that uh, marijuana as a product will be a legal product. Assemblywoman Crystal People Stokes has led the state's legalization effort for years. While final details are being ironed out today, here's what we know so far. Marijuana would be legalized for adults over 21. Personal possession would be allowed of up to three ounces, and New Yorkers would be able to grow their own plants right at home. Right away, the governor's office will begin setting up a brand new agency called the Office of Cannabis Management. The agency will establish guidelines and issue licenses for marijuana farming, processing, distribution, dispensaries, and even retail consumption sites. They'll also oversee the tax revenue. Percentages of it will be invested into the communities that have been harmed. Eli Northup is an attorney with the Bronx Defenders. He hopes the final deal will also include a provision to automatically wipe out past marijuana convictions from criminal records. Marijuana convictions can affect people in all these different ways outside of the criminal context. In the child welfare system, you know, when you're applying for housing, education. The governor's office estimates marijuana sales could bring the state $350 million a year in tax revenue. But Pew Charitable Trust researcher Adam Levin cautions. It's difficult to forecast how much revenue states are going to take in from uh, recreational marijuana, especially when it's being introduced for the first time. And for anyone still opposed to legal marijuana in the Empire State, the governor offered this. It's in New Jersey. It's in Massachusetts. To say we're going to stop it is not an option. So Tamsin and Corey, here's what we're expecting. As soon as this bill is signed, it should be legal to possess marijuana under three ounces here throughout New York State. But it may take months before you're able to actually go into a dispensary and purchase cannabis. And yes, it will be taxed at 13%. Reporting live from the Bronx this evening, Ayanna Harry, Pix 11 News.